All right, I'm gonna demonstrate how to give a medication IV push, this time using a preload medication, atropine. So first we're gonna make sure we have our BSI on, so I have my gloves and goggles, and we're going to explain the procedure to the patient, letting them know that we're gonna give them medication. We're also gonna go through our five patient rights, so make sure you have the right patient, right drug, right dose, right route, and right time. And we're going to uh, dice our medication before we administer it. Also asking if the patient has any allergies. So before we dice this, I've already diced my fluids and we already have an IV line established. So this I'm is just gonna, gonna check go. the patency to make sure that this IV is flowing correctly. So we'll open it up. It looks to be flowing well and I don't see any signs of infiltration. So I'll put that down to TKO for now. Now for our equipment here, we have our atropine sulfate. So I'm gonna dice this. So going through the dice, the drug is atropine sulfate. The dose that we're gonna give is gonna be uh, 0 0.5 milligrams. The integrity of the package looks good. The clarity we cannot see yet. And the concentration is 0 0.1 milligrams per ml. So with that concentration, we're gonna push five mLs to get that 0 0.5 milligrams. And also the expiration date is 8 of 2016. So to open this up, there's a little open tab here. Make sure you find that. Push in and lift that up. And we're gonna dice this one more time outside of the package. So it's atropine sulfate. The dose we're giving is 0 0.5 milligrams. The clarity looks good, the integrity looks good, and the concentration is still 0 0.1 milligrams per ml, and expiration date is the same. So we're going to pop both of these caps off, and we're gonna screw these two together until you meet some resistance. And we're going to make sure there's no bubbles, and we're gonna zero this out just pushing up on that plunger until it reaches the zero. Right about there. All right, and we're also going to have a flush ready, a 10 ml flush, and grab an alcohol prep and make sure you clean your port on the IV line. And atropine is gonna be a rapid push, so we're gonna push the atropine first, then we're gonna follow with a 10 ml flush, and then we'll open up our IV fluids. So we'll actually open this up prior to Take the cap off, secure it onto your line here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna pinch this line so that none of that medication goes back up into the bag. And then we're gonna rapidly push this up until we get to the five ml, also the 0.5 milligram line. So this is gonna be a rapid push. Make sure you stop at the correct level. And we'll disconnect it. Set that aside in case we need a second dose. We'll put our flush. Pinch above again, and flush with the full 10 cc's, or 10 mLs. We'll release, take that off. IV still running, we'll let that run for just a little bit. We'll set it back to TKO. And we're gonna reassess our patient, looking for any adverse effects, making sure, making sure we get the desired effects, and uh, make sure that our medication worked. And if for some reason it did not, we always have that second dose of 0.5 milligrams to give again later on.